Hey, today I'll be showing you how to fix the driver's error for your Motion Joy or also known as your DS3 for the PS3 or Xbox controller. And when you try to install the drivers, it will give you an error. So today I'll be showing you on how to fix that right now. Uh, and this is just a quick update for my previous video, which I did for Windows 8, and this is going to be for Windows 10. So yeah, so let's get started. Um, so you first go to start and then settings. You can get to settings two different ways. Well, there was this. There's other ways, but like the quick two ways that you can do it um, from there, from start and then settings, and then another one is from the not notification icon. You just click, click, and then all settings, and it will take you to this. And after this, what we're gonna do is um, go to update and security, and then go to recovery, and and from there we're gonna go, we're gonna advance setting, which is restart now. So we're just gonna click restart now and let the computer do its thing and we're just gonna wait for I don't know a couple of seconds or the, as I was telling you a couple of seconds and then after that troubleshoot and advanced option I guess this is pretty much the same process as the the one on Windows 8 it's just the the setting reboot come on computer don't take long okay Okay, so there you go. So what we're gonna do is disable driver's signature enforcement, which is seven, and you can either press the number on your keyboard or the function key. So I'm just gonna press the function key, which is F7. F7, yes, disable signature enforcement, yes. Okay, and you're good to go. After that, you're just good to go. Okay, once you put in your password, or if you don't have a password, so now what you want to do is open DS3 or Motion Joy and go to drivers, just click yes, and drivers again, and I only have one controller uh, plugged in right now, so I'm just gonna install this driver and install all, and it should work, come on. And take your time okay and there you go and that's how you fix your driver for your ps3 or xbox controller on pc windows 10 so if you, this helped you uh, give it a thumbs up and comment in the section below if you have any other questions and yeah so bye